So we've heard a lot in the news lately about the Confederate flag and the meaning behind it. And whether you take pride in that flag or any other flag that flies, it is a powerful symbol, one that might be missing in Austin. In Austin, you don't have to look far to find someone running the trail or paddleboarding on the lake. But if you look up, even outside City Hall, the Austin flag is nowhere to be found. I looked for it online and you can find maybe one image of it, but uh, really it's, it's kind of hard to find. As a graphic design student at UT, Alex Rios looked at that as an opportunity, especially when Austin's flag was called on the carpet during a recent TED talk that went viral. Here's the thing about municipal seals. They were designed to be on pieces of paper where you can read them. Not on flags, 100 feet away, flapping in the breeze. And as you can see, Austin's flag is the municipal seal. So Alec got to work redesigning a new flag. I wanted to take those same elements but make them larger. Um, so now it takes up the whole space of the flag. I felt compelled to do it, you know, to redesign the flag. Michael Kriekhauser was inspired by the same talk and came up with his own design, using a single star to represent the state capitol and a flame of knowledge for Austin's educational past. It's this great opportunity to give this extra branding component, this extra bit of civic pride to the city. Alec envisions his flag on pins, pillows, or displays. It appears the only display of the current flag that dates back to 1919 is over at the Austin History Center. An old newspaper article details the flag's lack of importance. It had been uh, sitting in uh, a desk drawer in the city clerk's office for a long time, uh, and in the 70s someone found it, and they decided that it, it would be better served flat and framed as opposed to, you know, folded in a brown paper sack in someone's desk drawer. We need a flag that can sit alongside the, the Lone Star State's flag as a cousin, as a compliment to say, welcome to the state of Texas, welcome to Austin. And I tried contacting the mayor's office to see if he would ever consider a new flag. I didn't hear back. And it turns out it was the mayor back in 1915 that thought Austin needed its own flag. He had a design contest, and a man from San Francisco ended up coming up with the current design. And he also won 50 bucks.